Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Resident Evil. Um, unfortunately I don't have an intro for the uh, part of video that you're about to see. So here's my intro. I hope you guys enjoy and welcome to another episode. Okay, let's shove some stuff in here. Oh. Oh. Oh, crank. Sure. Dude, what the fuck? I fucked myself. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Uh, let's not fight this woman. I swear to god, if these crows attack me, I will actually fight them. <laughs> well, obviously. <sighs> I do not like whoever that was. That was not a bit of me. Um, they're a bit creepy. Looks like they had their they had they had their face murdered off. I don't understand why I'm guessing it's a she. I don't understand why she knocked us out. Then yeah, I don't understand why she knocked us out and then started attacking us once we'd woken up. Like, you've knocked us out. You can just kill us. Like, it's not the end of the world. I mean, it would be for us. But, um, like, it's not deep. Okay, who's ready to use the crank? Oh, fuck. I'm forgetting that it's like, you have to manually press use. It doesn't just like, do you want to use the crank here? Yes. So also, I thought, it, I think sometimes it should open up your inventory. You can hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance. Right, I'm going to keep that crank on me because I can see that coming very handy. Oh, what's going to hurt me as I... Walk across this. Nothing. Excuse me, where are we going? I don't know, but there's a blue thing there. We're getting cut up by a load of bloody pigeons. Yeah, that's right, I called you pigeon. Is that a snake? Nah, fuck you. Nah. Nah. I ain't no fucking... I ain't fighting no snakes. No. No, 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 no. Not today. Why? Why you gotta be like this? Ooh. I don't like this house. Oh, we're in a residence. Okay. <gasps> Ink ribbons! Oh my god, I've missed you. Yes! I'd love to. The door plate reads number one. Is Vecna in there? Hail, Lord Vecna. Uh, 
the man was too stunned to speak. Num number two. Oh, we can go number two. Couldn't go number one, but we can go number two. <laughs> that was a weird phrase. Um, I hate when it gives you... Oh, plant 42. Four days have passed since the accident. The plant at point 42 is growing at an amazing rate. Although there are many unknown aspects about this plant, we know that in comparison with the other group of plants, the T-virus has been has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. The T-virus has drastically morphed its host anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. Nowhere on earth will you find anything like it. We've also found that Plant 42 has two main sources has two main sources of acquiring its necessary nutrients. One source is through its roots. Somehow it has rooted itself down into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and destroyed the aqua ring. Ever since, the basement has been like a pool. There is a high possibility it's one of the chemicals in the water that's promoting the Plant 42's rapid growth. However, we have yet to determine the specific chemical. A bulb-like body of the Plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling on the first floor. We are sure that it used the air ducts to reach the first floor. Numerous long tentacle-like vines are protruding from the bulb. We believe the vines are the second means of acquiring nutrients. When the plant 42 senses prey, it uses the tentacle-like vines to capture its prey. After doing so, suckers on the vine drain the prey of its blood. We are... <laughs> We've also noticed that it has some intelligence. When it captures its prey or when it's inactive, the vines twine around the door to stop possible intruders. Unfortunately, several of our scientists have fallen victim to this Plant 42. When we heard the stories from the survivors, they all observed one thing in common. When the uniform petal-like flaps open and reveal its vital internals, it has a tendency to become more aggressive. One witness reported that it was as if it was trying to protect itself. Why it behaves the way it does is still unknown. Jesus Christ. Oh, no. Oh. No, I want to go back up because I want to burn that fucker. Because that fucker's going to come get me. Yes. I'm running dangerously low on ammo. Yeah, fuck you. There's this room as well. And I don't know what it is. Oh, there's something here. There is a residence key. Yes, I will take that. There's a map of the residence. Yes, I would love to take that. Thank you very much. You got the map of the residence. There's a hole in the wall here. You see a giant beehive. Oh, that's not good. Don't attack me. I'm gonna need to take a minute. I I don't think I can go in there. I do not like spiders. And oh, there's no further use for this key. But isn't there like a oh do I need like a gallery key then? Jeez. Oh. Okay, let's go in here first. I don't want to. I don't want to go near the swinging body just yet. Control room key. Right, you're getting burnt up, you fucker. Oh, fuck. I will take the self-defense gun as well. Suicide note. I had to do it. We ran from those things, helping each other to survive, but symptoms... But Robert started to show symptoms. I had to do it. Those damn things are pure evil. There was no other way. He would have done the same if it were... The other way around. 
After I put him out of his misery, I just had to leave him in that bathroom. Now I'm probably the last one. How could this happen? I'll never forgive myself for being a part of this project. Eventually, I'll get what's coming to me though. There's no way to escape from this nuthouse. It's just a matter of time now. Everything is set. All I need is a little courage to get it done. Knowing that I'll leave many things undone is a regret beyond words. But this is better than just waiting to turn into one of them. Please understand and at least let me end my life as a person. There's a message on the back. Linda, please forgive me. Is that all of the items in this room? No, there's still more. Um, another magazine clip. Now is that all the... Yay, it's green. Cool. Fine with me. Cool. Oh, we've got to go. We've got to, oh, we've got to get into the spider room. Oh. I don't know if I can. I actually genuinely don't know if I can. Um, there's still something in this hallway. So, oh, it's all the blue plants, isn't it? Mm. Uh, combine with that. Where's the nearest typewriter? Literally down the corridor. Okay, let's go. Is it, is it this room? I have a feeling this is outside. Yeah, it's outside. Um, so I'm pretty sure those spiders poison you as well. Ooh. I. Ooh. No, no, no. I might cry. I. Just get through the room. Oh, what's this? Yeah, sure. Uh, oh, there's also a first aid box, but I don't want it. I just want to leave. Oh, this house is a nightmare. There's spiders. There's a plant thing in the basement let's 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 just go down sure what's the worst that can happen we die probably but i'm gonna i'm gonna be optimistic okay well, there's a door here first. It's locked from the other side. Oh. Oh, and I'm guessing now I can just run across. Yeah. Cool. Okay. What? Excuse me? Oh, oh, okay. That's a shark. That's that's a that's a massive shark. Uh sure. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. No, this sounds about right. Yeah, discard the key. Okay, I'm glad I kept the control room key on me. What the fuck? There's sharks, there's spiders, there was a massive snake. What else is there? Gonna give me a massive moth or something? Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Well, that's not good. Reaching 30% of pressure threshold. Oh, I don't understand. What? What am I meant to do? Warning lamp indicates there is an emergency. Really? Yes. Reaching 
reaching 95% of pressure threshold. This is bullshit. This is absolute bullshit. All personnel, prepare for impact. Ah, uh, me too. Okay. This is this is some bullshit. But it won't budge until the safety's released. Oh, you fucker. Yes. No. Oh, yeah, I get it. Right. <sighs> Fuck you, game. That was... That was not pleasant. That was not pleasant in the slightest. What do you mean this is not the time? What else have I got to do? Oh, now... Yes. The water's been completely drained. Oh, so they're now just like... Bloody things just flopping about in the water like wah, wah. Ooh. Okay, cool. It's dead. Fucking shark things. Cool. Cool. Doesn't have any power. Yes. Oh fuck. Oh, oh I see. Okay. So we gotta pull the lever up, yeah. And then we push it in and then we turn it on. Nice. Okay. Yeah. We're having shark fin soup tonight. Hey, I got a, I got a, um, an achievement. It was called Deep Six or something like that. Oh, I got the gallery key. There is no further use for this key. Cool. Fine by me. Those bees, leave me alone. I know I need the knife. I should probably keep the knife on me, but it's just taking up valuable space that I don't have. Oh my God. You're being serious. Oh. Block from the other side, bro. Bro. It's locked, bro. Just what I wanted. A corpse with a contorted expression. He's holding something. Killer. Matriarch. Fuck. Right. Oh, 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 that's the wasp. It's too dangerous to go any further. You think? Right, okay, fuck this, fuck this. Oh my god. It's almost as if I didn't expect it. Yeah, thank you, please leave me alone. He's holding something. Insecticide spray. Oh, do I? Oh, I think I know what I do. I think I have to spray it in the... I have to spray it in the hole, guys. You know what? I like bees. 
I don't like these bees. Residence key, so that must be the for number three. Yes, discard the key. Why why isn't there just one for everyone? Like it's so inconvenient having three different keys for three different rooms. Oh right, what the fuck's in here? Typewriter. Alright. Well, I don't like this room. A giant plant is crushing the wall. A swarm of angry moths surrounds it. Your blue is blocked by a dense thicket of trees. That's in my blue. I think I'm at my, my view. Um, there's more ink ribbons. The shelf is lined with red books. Yes. Organic. The similarities in the cellular characteristics of the rapidly growing plant infected by the tyrant virus have been reported in previous papers. However, while reading these experiments, an interesting new fact became clear. We learned the chemical in the UMB family, UMB number 20, contains a compound that is toxic to the cell of the plants. We have given UMB number 20 a new name, V-Jolt. If calculations prove correct, when V-Jolt is applied directly to the root of the plant, the entire plant should be dead within 10 seconds five seconds the v gel can be made by simply mixing the vp and the ump chemicals in a specific ratio however extra care must be taken when handling these ump 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 chemicals they have been known to generate toxic gases if mishandled what um the characteristics of ump chemicals are as follows Yeah, it's because this goes there. Reorder them. Um. Oh. There's a secret door. Spooky. We love that. Chris! Rebecca! It's no use. The roots are in the basement. You can... No! Take that file. It'll tell you how to make the potion to kill this thing. Use it on its roots. Sorry. Chris. Wait, are we playing as Rebecca now? Wait, where are we going? How do we, how do we get down to the basement? Okay, guys, I think I'm gonna end the video there on that cliffhanger. Um, make sure to like the video, comment, subscribe, do all that YouTube stuff. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Keep on ranting. Bye.